Hello to everyone and welcome to today's video. We're having another Logitech peripheral extravaganza. Now here we have the G560 2.1 speaker system with Luma trigger and light sync, uh, well, light synchronization. And what's all of that about? Well, stay tuned and after the intro, we're going to talk more about it, of course. <laughs> On top of the speaker we have the plus and minus to adjust your volumes and you have the G button that is actually specialized for the brightness of your LEDs on your speaker so you could adjust no brightness at all so you turn it off you have small or low medium and high brightness. First of all, I'm testing the speakers and the light sync through the Battlefield 1 game to check out how, how they synchronize with the colors on the monitor and the next part will be synchronizing these speakers to the bass and highs and lows of the music. So let's check it out first Battlefield, then we have the music. Through the Logitech gaming software you can adjust your colors, your effects, uh, do you want them to be synchronized with your other peripherals, do you want them to be synchronized to music or to the colors on your main monitor. So it all depends on you and it's very easy uh, because Logitech gaming software is very user friendly and there is actually no fuss about it. But let me show you with all the other stuff that I showed you before. Uh, this part, let's try the music part again and see how the bass and highs and lows actually affect the LEDs on your speakers. I'm going to explain to you later on about the beta version of the Logitech gaming software but for now let's open some pictures I have some cars here uh, which are going to be synchronizing colors with your speakers and I found that as the best solution to see how the colors transfer directly to your LEDs on your speakers and how they actually give you the effect that your monitor is all over your room or your gaming area as you can see we're talking today about logitech g560 luma trigger 2.1 speakers now 2.1 means two speakers and you have the subwoofer over here now what is uh, 
so interesting about these speakers? Well, Luma Trigger and Light Sync enable you to play games and get the effect outside of the monitor. So when you, for instance, play Battlefield 1 like I did, the colors on your speakers sync up with the colors in your game or, I don't know, uh, desktop wallpaper, anything particularly on your monitor and they copy the colors <coughs> to produce the colors here on the speakers to get a better effect while gaming or doing anything else. Also, you could uh, do on your speakers, on the color uh, side, you could do the cyclone color like I placed it right now. You can do the breathing effect and you can do the visualizer for your music. With the G506, uh, you have three ways to connect your speakers. First is via USB, then we have the Bluetooth and 3.5 uh, millimeter jack that you connect to your any device practically that you wish. Now I haven't tested because I don't have, by coincidence, 3.5 millimeter jack to test it on my phone, but these are right now connected directly through the USB and that is why the lights work like uh, like this. Now as for the lights and how they function, the rear lights function as the as they follow the base and the front lights react to the mids and highs getting a better let's say visualization of of the music. Now let's talk about some specifications right uh, the Logitech G560 2.1 speakers have uh, total watts in peak 240 and in the RMS they have 120 watts. Now as you can see here you have a subwoofer, you have two speakers, uh, it also functions as I said earlier on Bluetooth and the distance between the speakers and the device is 25 meters. It also has one USB port that you can connect it to the subwoofer and directly to your computer. It works with uh, all Windows operational systems 7, uh, 8.1 and 10. You could uh, use it to connect it with USB to your PCs and with 3.5 millimeter jack you could connect it to a console or a mobile phone. Uh, also with Bluetooth you could connect it to your computer laptop to your tablet to your mobile phone and it will work it also has the uh, DTSX uh, ultra engine that renders 3d audio through your uh, games and music through your to your speakers which gives you more accuracy to the sound which gives you your realistic like let's say like you're in the game but it gives you a better perception of the sound while playing something now unboxing the G560, I have to say uh, the box is really big, but comparing it to the speakers, now the speakers are very, very small and I was really shocked to see a big box like that and then I realized this subwoofer is taking the two thirds of the box that it is packed. Now I'm really impressed with the lights and how they follow uh, in-game uh, colors and how they transfer it to the speakers. I have to also say that I couldn't at this moment test it with the uh, full release of the Logitech gaming software. I had to get the better version just to test it out. So there are few bugs still, but when the G560 uh, comes out on the market, it will definitely be polished out without a single glitch, without a doubt, of course. Uh, as for the other stuff like the sound delivering and everything else, I tested it without the lights because on the beta version it just didn't function properly, that's why it's called beta, but the sound is really crisp and the thing is even the bass is brutal, uh, I have to compare with my Z906, it's just I'm really on the edge on deciding which one is better but uh, what I wanted to say is that the 
G560 uh, have a recommendation directly from Logitech that when you connect your speakers you should lower down your windows volume just in case it doesn't blast through because I did that mistake and they were really loud it was 100% uh, sound and I was really shocked how actually at the highest volume the sound is still crisp and very clear and it doesn't have any problem with the membrane or it doesn't vibrate or it doesn't make any strange noise so guys thank you for watching this was uh, let's say first impression unboxing and a bit of a review for the Logitech G560 2.1 uh, gaming speaker set with light sync and luma trigger to follow your games outside of the monitors uh, thank you for watching, don't forget to check the links below for more details about the G560 and of course the Logitech website where you can find everything else about their peripherals. Uh, thanks, see you next time, more cool stuff coming as usual very very soon, see ya, bye!